In this video, we will show you the worst financial mistakes in the history by individuals, starting with a loss of 3 million dash, all the way up to a mistake costing $2.4 billion. Our first story is about Sir Isaac Newton, a name synonymous with scientific genius. Newton, known for his groundbreaking work in physics, also ventured into the world of finance. He invested in the South Sea Company, a major entity in early 18th century England, known for its monopoly on trade in the South Seas. Initially, Newton profited from his investment, but was drawn back in his stock price of sort. He invested more at the peak of the market, only to watch it collapse soon after. In today's terms, Newton lost about $3 million, a stark reminder that even brilliant minds can misjudge the market. Next, we turn to Mark Twain, the beloved American author. Twain, captivated by technological innovation, invested heavily in the Page Compositor, a complex and advanced typesetting machine. He envisioned it revolutionizing the printing industry. Unfortunately, the machine was too complicated and failed to be commercially viable. Twain's investment, equivalent to $8 million today, was lost, leading him to financial ruin. This story highlights the risks involved in investing in improving technology, no matter how promising it may seem. We then look at Masayoshi Sun, the founder of SoftBank, a major player in the tech industry. Sun decided to invest in Bitcoin, the well-known digital currency that has seen dramatic fluctuations in value. He bought in at a high price. Unfortunately, sold after a significant drop, resulting in a loss of around $130 million. This experience is a classic example of the high-risk nature of cryptocurrency investments and the challenges of market time. Next we got Sean Coyne, once Ireland's richest man. Quinn made a massive investment in Anglo-Irish Bank, an Irish bank that played a central role in the Irish financial crisis. His investment was through complex financial instruments known as Contracts for Difference CFDs. When the 2008 financial crisis hit, the bank's shares plummeted, leading to Quinn's dramatic loss of around $2.4 billion and eventually his bankruptcy. This example serves as a warning about the risks of investing heavily in a single sector, especially banking, which can be highly vulnerable to economic downturns. Finally, we have the story of John Merriweather, a famous Wall Street trader, is our next subject. He established Long-Term Capital Management, LTCM, a hedge fund that initially performed exceptionally well. However, LTCM was heavily reliant on complex, high-risk trading strategies. In 1998, these strategies failed spectacularly, leading to a loss of $4.6 billion in a matter of four months. Merriweather's case is a cautionary tale about the dangers of aggressive, leverage-based investment strategies, which can lead to dramatic losses. These stories, spanning several centuries and in industries, show us that financial errors can happen to anyone, regardless of their expertise or experience. They remind us of the importance of thorough research, diversification, and caution when investing. Thank you for joining us on this journey through financial history. If you found these stories insightful, please like this video, subscribe for more content, and share your thoughts in the comments below. Until next time, may your investments be wise and well